G'day guys, g'day, 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 how you doing today, hopefully you're all feeling good, we're joined by Tanya, hi, yes, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be watching Friends, season 6, episode 15, can you remember what it's called? Uh, no. This one right here. The one where Chandler can cry, no, we've seen that one. Alright. The one that could have been parts 1 and 2. Okay, that's Are you it. sure that's it? Yeah, okay. the one that could have been parts one and two. So it's episode fifteen. So this must be two. Must be part two. No, we haven't been. We the haven't one watched. that yeah. could have been parts one. We've already seen. Uh, this is the last episode. The one with the joke. No, the one with the joke we is haven't already not? seen. No. I am pretty sure. Let me have a look. The one with the joke we've uh, we have already watched. Is that one where they published the joke in uh, Playboy magazine? Let me just, let me just, let me just, let me just, let's have a look. 6.15. We've already done 14. See the one that could have been part one and part two. We haven't watched part one. Okay, so the one that could have been part one and part two we're going to watch. Mm-hmm. All right. So, yep, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be watching it with uh, right here, right there. That's how we're going to be watching it, ladies and gentlemen. I picked up these from, where did I get them from? From Australia. From Australia. From where? When, like, four years ago when I wanted you to watch them and you Four years ago watch when them. Tanya wanted me to watch them and, you didn't and watch them. I couldn't find it anywhere. So, um, I think it was a Salvation Army. No, it was one of the markets. Ah, one of the markets. Oh, yeah, the the Melville markets. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. We went to the Melville markets, and I think I got these and Dexter. And, um, yeah, it comes with all the discs, guys. All the discs, yeah. And the reason why we're doing it like this as well, because, as you see, you get a bonus disc. So now, yeah. once we finish the season, we're going to be watching the bonus disc for you guys at home um, because it, it adds all the gag features, reels, and everything like that. And I think that'd be pretty cool. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, number cool. one, season one, we could go through and watch the bonus disc as well. We haven't yeah. seen the bonus disc, so... Mm -hmm. Yep, we might do that at the end of this season. We might go to one, two, three, four, and five and look at all the bonus features on all the other discs. So, okay. anyway, ladies and gentlemen, let's get right into this. I'll let Tanya put it in. Can you put it in? Do you know how to put it in, Tanya? No. Tanya is usually an expert at putting things in, so I'll just allow Tanya to do it. Here you go, Tanya. Can you please put it in for me? Go right ahead. Right. We have a DVD player here. Put it in, well, please, you, Tanya. You don't know how to put it in? Put it in. Uh, uh, that's the wrong way around. <laughs> I, thought, I thought you said I'm an expert. Like that. Uh, okay. okay. Cut that. I'm an expert. Tanya's an expert. There you go. Put it in. There you go. Uh, I can't click it. I can't click it. There you go. I did it all by myself. I didn't need any help. <sighs> Yay. There we go. All right, we're going to cut to it, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully you did enjoy that. It will <laughs> be better next time. Tanya will know how to put it in, right? All right. I'm not too sure about that. Let's go. Let's rock and roll. Let's dance. Barry and Mindy are getting a divorce. Barry and Mindy. I hear divorce. I immediately go to Ross. <laughs> Barry was the guy that I almost married, and Mindy was my best friend. Oh, oh, wasn't he cheating on you with her? Yeah, but that just means that he was falling asleep on top of her instead of me. See, there you uh, go. Can you imagine if I'd actually married him? I mean, how different would my life be? If I'd never gotten divorced. Which time? The first time. <laughs> well, seriously, imagine if Carol hadn't realized she was a lesbian. No, I can't. I keep seeing it the good way. <laughs> Oh, God, and then I'd Joey. still be doing my karate. Karate. <laughs> Towards the my end of karate. our marriage, I was doing a lot of karate as a way of releasing the tension. Maybe the problem was you were pronouncing it karate. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what if I was still fat? What? You guys really think I'm that shallow? No, I just think Monica was that fat. <laughs> Imagine if I never got fired up days of our life. There's Carol again. Oh, my God. <laughs> what if I had had the guts to quit my job? I don't have to wear a tie. <laughs> what if I had taken that job at Merrill Lynch? 
Lynch. Yeah, I had a massage client who worked there, and well, why didn't you take the job? That time, you see, I thought that everything that rhymed was true. And only eat locks and have a pet box. Really? Hey, really? Think if all those things happened, we'd still hang out. Do we get to actually listen to it? <laughs> oh, they're actually going to play the full thing now on the DVD. Yeah, because it's Fat Monica. What could have... Oh my God, Rachel Green. Rob Tillman. <laughs> No, no, it's, it's me, Ross. Ross Tillman. Oh. No, 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 Ross Geller. Of course, Monica's brother. Yeah, right. I'm, I'm married. Oh, me too. Oh. <laughs> this isn't it the best? Yeah, right. It's the best. Mm. <sighs> so, um, how's Monica? Oh, really, really great. You know what? You should stop by and say hi. Oh, I would love to. Busty ladies. <laughs> It's okay, some some kid asked me to pick it up for him, but uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Monica, you're still going out with Dr. Boring, huh? He's not boring, he's, he's just So that's what this whole episode's gonna be about. He's just Jesus. low key. The hazelnut, actually not a nut, it's a seed. Wow. <laughs> Can anyone else name a well-known seed that's been masquerading as a nut? Dear God, let me <laughs> My balls. My balls. <laughs> What the oh, hell? The rejection letter. They said my writing was funny, just not Archie comic funny. <laughs> you know what, honey? I gotta get back to the hospital. Mm. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. The answer is the Brazil nut. <laughs> What's his question? What's more boring than him? <laughs> hey, sorry about that Archie thing. You uh, need me to give you some money? I may have no money, but I still have my pride. This is this is weird. Really? Yeah. Uh. Uh. Joey doesn't have to give you the money. Hey, if I hire an assistant, would you take money from her? No, Joey. Chandler could <laughs> be your assistant. He's a freaking idiot. See, you could answer all your fan mail and stuff. All right, now. <laughs> hey, I need to use the bathroom. Since I don't need any assistance in there. Take a break. All right. <laughs> Thank you. There you go. Hey. Hey, Phoebe. Hey. Joey just hired Chandler to be his assistant. Hang on! <laughs> go. What the go. hell? Okay. okay. It's okay. You're allowed one mistake. Just kidding. You are, of course, fired. This is so weird, dude. This is so hey, weird. Come on. Hey. Come on. Look who I ran into. God, Rachel! <laughs> oh! Did you lose weight? You were so sweet to notice. Yes, I lost three and a half pounds. <laughs> and uh, you, you remember my friend Chandler? Yeah. And, uh, and, yeah. and that's Phoebe over there. Hi. Oh, my God. We've seen each other. Oh. 1987, the day after Christmas, uh, Sean McMahon's party. I, I played you one of my songs. Oh, yeah. I remember that episode. Do you still, yeah. do, you still do music? <laughs> Joey Triviani from Days of Our Lives just walked in here. This okay. is so weird, dude. Ours. You are friends with Dr. Drake Ramore? <laughs> It's kind of hard to be friends with Drake, the fact that he's not real. <laughs> or I could bring my keyboard here sometime. Just come, just come over. Joey! I know, here, here. This is my friend Rachel. <laughs> we went to high school together. Hey. <laughs> I love you on that show. I mean, when you took out your own kidney to save your ex-wife, even though she tried to kill you. <laughs> okay. Well, it's always nice to meet the fans. Uh, She's not crazy, is she? <laughs> So, uh, how are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> That's the meme. God's sakes. Hang on. What kind of name is Brindy? <laughs> All right, um, from now on, your name is Joan. Okay. You can pick your own last name. No, no. <laughs> hey, there you are. Uh oh, it's my boss. <laughs> All right, here's a list of things for you to do today, man. I'm delivering twins today, but only one of them is mine. Drop off my dry cleaning. Teach me how to spell vitamins. <laughs> you realize what you are, don't you? What? <laughs> You're his bitch. <laughs> you didn't just sit on my Kit Kats, did you? <laughs> no, there was Get a up. little in the market, and I lost $13 million. But the Kit Kats are all right. <laughs> what? I can't call my clients. They'll kill themselves. <laughs> Great. Now my chest hurts. Uh, my chest hurts. <laughs> and now I, I can't breathe. Are you having a heart attack? Would I have shooting pains up and down my left arm? Yes. Then yes, that is what I'm having. <laughs> she just takes a drag. <laughs> I'm having a heart attack. Come on, Phoebe.
boobs, it's not that bad. Most people don't like their jobs. I love my job. I miss Joan. <laughs> Honey, having a heart attack is nature's way What's of telling you to die. What's her last name? That's down. the question. Yeah. I always thought having a heart attack was nature's way of telling you to die. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you are going to die, but you're not going to die today. Making I wish better. I was dead. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a walk. You know, maybe you should consider writing for Talking Out of Your Ass magazine. <laughs> Well, um, well, I've been uh, doing a lot more karate. My karate. <laughs> karate. Still going through that dry spell with Carol. How long has it been since you've had sex? Last weekend. Oh, that's not so bad. Will be two months <laughs> since I stopped trying. <laughs> Maybe you need to spice things up a little. You could tie her up. She could tie you up. You could eat stuff off each other. Dirty talk. Menage a trois. Toys. Wow. <laughs> role-playing you could be the warden she could be the prisoner you could be the pirate she could be the wench i don't think it's the fact yeah. that or two you could be two stockbrokers rolling around naked on the trading floor and everybody's watching <laughs> it never happened i think maybe the fact that she is lesbian i like to unwind after a long day of surgeoning wow surgeoning oh, so what else? What surgeoning else? Uh, well that is a large piece of television equipment huh? hey old man hey all righty the old man doesn't even say anything <laughs> <laughs> Can't the world stop turning? <laughs> Just for a moment. Just for us. Is that a line from the show? I may have said those things before, but I never truly meant them. <laughs> Until now. That's a line from the show, too! <laughs> okay, you watch too much TV. <laughs> yeah, there's pulp in that. I don't like pulp. Like the pulp. Rachel, would you like a soda or something? <laughs> Well, sure, iced tea would be great. Okay. Iced tea. <laughs> Anything for you, sir? Should I not just tell him? <laughs> you have got to listen. <laughs> Dude, this is you know, so awkward. Juice, yeah. It's not all juice. Dude, this is so awkward. It's, so it's weird. Maybe someday we could get a place with two bathrooms. <laughs> <laughs> but, Carol, um, I mean... He can't. Even, was, poor fella. Maybe, uh, maybe we can spice things up a little. Poor fella can't even take a break. Even in this old, like, even in this alternate universe, he's still being shunned by Carol. <laughs> he's still being hated by women. <laughs> poor fella. Dad! Hey there, little fella. Why don't you show Dad how you can put your shoes on in your room? Yay! <laughs> Seriously, our sex life. <laughs> I don't know, we could try some, some new things, you know, for fun. <sighs> Tie each other up. <laughs> um, some people... What the was that? Eat stuff off one another. <laughs> Dirty talk. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, could have a threesome. I love that idea. I wonder <laughs> who she wants to do it comics. with. <laughs> My last kid get more. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't want to give it up. Uh, it's just, I hate pulp. You know? <laughs> okay. I, you know how mom feels about low-fat mayonnaise? It's not me! <laughs> I just wanted to say, I'm sorry. And here, fresh squeezed orange juice with pulp. Chandler sold a story to Archie Comics. Well, what's the story? Oh, you wouldn't uh, care. It's just a stupid comic oh. book story. Are you kidding me? I love Archie. It's about Joey. Gang. Archie needs money to fix his jalopy. <laughs> So Reggie hires him as his assistant, <laughs> as his butler, <laughs> him milkshakes that can't have lumps in them. That sounds a little familiar. They already do that one because I think I read it. <laughs> <laughs> Joey Tribbiani invited me back to his apartment. Now, does he do this with a lot of girls? Yeah, a lot. A lot, a lot. <laughs> Believe this, I mean Joey Trivia. So weird. Oh, yeah, it's none of my business, but aren't you married? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I just wish we could be like on a break. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're not. <laughs> oh, it's so easy for you. I mean, you're they not. They were on a break. Whoever you want. Yeah, I can. <laughs> <laughs> Monica, mm -hmm. you've done it, right? Oh, what do you think I'm like? Some 30-year-old virgin. <laughs> oh, my God! You're a 30-year-old virgin! <laughs> Say it louder. I don't think the guy all the way in the back heard 
you? Yeah, I heard it. <laughs> <laughs> what is he facing? It's not like I haven't had the opportunity. He's facing you know, the wall. I was thinking maybe I should just get it over with. You know, give him my flower. <laughs> Oh my God, do it. Honey, you've waited long enough. There shouldn't be all these rules and restrictions. I'm never gonna think it's okay for you to cheat on your husband. Oh, what do you know, virgin? <laughs> I do have to admit, this episode is really weird. Why I, I want to try and find it funny, bathroom? but it's just so weird. Oh yeah, the doctor said that could be one of the side effects. <laughs> it's not a cigarette, the smoke is coming out of me. <laughs> The smoke is coming so out. And you're here. I got it. Oh, give it to me. I got it. Give it. Oh, Karate. 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 Oh, right. No problem. Okay, bye bye. Were they mad? Was it Jack? Did he yell? No, Jack just was calling to make sure you were getting better. Yeah, she's fine. <laughs> You've done all you can, Doctor Wesley. Goodbye and Godspeed, Hope Brady. Not so fast, Wesley. <laughs> I'm all right. That's right, Wesley. You're not a real doctor. <laughs> and that woman's brain is fine. Oh, thank God. <laughs> what the f is going on? Dude, Hope. this is so weird. Hope you're gonna live a long, healthy life with me. Okay. There we go. Hi, Joey. It's Rachel. Um, I am free tomorrow night. And sure, her name is Hope. <laughs> the reason time is it. And her name is Hope. <laughs> Excellent. What do you think about this episode? Oh, uh, the episode was quite good. I enjoyed it. It was, uh, at times it was, I do have to admit, at times it was a little bit weird. Yeah. But I, I don't know. I think it's because we know what the characters are like, yeah? I, I wanted to laugh a lot more, but it's just, I don't know. I felt so weird watching that episode. I felt like... I was watching something completely different. I don't know why, but it's hard, oh, dude. That's <coughs> that's a parallel universe. Yeah. Have you ever thought what? Where, where, no, where I you, don't. Where I don't want to be right now. If you changed some decision in your life. No, I no. I don't think about those sorts of things at all. I think about like I have thought about another universe where there is another version of myself existing and I would be like someone completely different or non-existent. Um, I have thought about that, but not like, oh, it, I'll be doing something different and like, nah, I haven't thought about it like that. But that stuff is, uh, yeah, that stuff is like, crazy. Like what would have happened if you never left Australia, you never came to Spain? Yeah, but I do. I, I always believe like things happen for a reason. Yeah, yeah like, but it's, it's fun to, to imagine that. Like, yeah, yeah. I'm not the type of person that does do that though. I don't know why. I just never been like that. Like, like what? Or what happens if I walk down that alleyway instead of that alleyway? I've never been that type of person. I don't know why. I just never have been like that. Maybe you are. No, maybe because I'm very curious and I love multiple universes and parallel yeah. worlds and things like that. I think about that stuff. Yeah. But I think it's just because of my obsession with everything related to that. <laughs> so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah no, no no not really not really thought about it like that but like yeah yeah i mean it's funny seeing the characters doing something completely different than it was like i was watching another what? tv show <laughs> it honestly was it honestly felt like i was watching another <laughs> tv show yeah yeah. Well, there you go. Guys, let me know in the comment section if you feel weird watching that too. Yeah, I, I really might have funny. to go wash really my funny. eyes or something because really I feel funny. dirty. It's really funny, like Chandler uh, being Joey's assistant and Joey... Being Joey's bitch. Joey giving him money when it's actually the yeah, other Yeah, that was so and... weird. That was so <laughs> Rachel weird. Rachel with Joey, that. like what the heck is going on? Phoebe being like all successful. And I think the women. funniest one is um, is Monica. And, and yeah, Monica Especially still... dancing at the end there. Yeah, and Ross and her still with, with, with Carol. They're gonna have a, a threesome. A threesome, and I wonder who's gonna be the third one. Yeah, I wonder <laughs> who it's gonna be. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. There you go. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy that. Let us know in the comment section down below. Peace out. Enjoy the rest of your day, and we'll speak soon. Bye bye. Bye.